How you doing? Name's Roy. It's a pleasure to meet you. I just saw this little video demonstration here about visual thinking. So I thought I'd demonstrate it for all of you watchers today. Now I've never done this before, so we're gonna have to do something a little simple. I thought some shapes. I figured we'd uh, start off with my favorite shape here, a uh, rectangle, okay? It's much harder than you think, you know. Oh, there it is. That's beautiful. A rectangle. You see rectangles here. They're used for things such as boxes and building blocks and things of that nature, you see? And see how uh, they're... Oh. An anvil. Yeah, I guess an anvil works. <coughs> oh. Oh. I'm gonna feel that one tomorrow. All right, let's try uh, something a little safer here. Well, uh, we'll do a circle. How about that? Oh, what harm has ever come from a circle? Yeah. Oh, look at that. A circle. You see, circles are used for uh, used for balls and uh, maybe some eyes, like mine, and uh, lit fuse. Nice. Oh. Okay, huh. let's try one more, all right? Whew. We'll do a, we'll do a nice, safe triangle. How about that? All right. Oh, man, I hope this works. Ah. Wow, all right, there it is. All right, so triangles are used for things like Mountains and uh, ice cream cones. Hmm. Hmm. Witch's hat. Very clever. With that, we come to the conclusion. So for my finale, I'll be visualizing an exit. How do I visualize myself back to me again? <laughs> 